how to claim the Sologenic XRP airdrop. Welcome back Flare community. Today we're going to look at the solo airdrop on the XRP ledger and the snapshots and more specifically how you can claim it via either a Zoom account or even a hardware wallet such as a ledger or a decent device. Now before we jump in, let's just go over some of the details. Here is Bob Russ, who is actually the co-creator at Sologenic. And basically, this snapshot takes place on the 24th of December, Christmas Eve. What a treat. The distribution will take place on the 20th of January, 2022. And yes, it's a free airdrop for those who hold both the solo token and also XRP. And that's what we're going to get into today. But before we do, let's have a quick look at the project itself. So we're going to scroll down a little bit here and start. Let's start here. Sologenic Decentralized Exchange is one of the most popular DEX gateways to the XRP ledger. And a gateway being a way that you can bring value off the XRP ledger onto the XRP ledger. At the time of writing this post, the decentralized exchange has over 2 million views per month and an average of 150,000 transactions going through the Sologenic decentralized exchange on a weekly basis. Now, it's very popular and it's basically an interface where you can interact with the XRP ledgers in built decentralized exchange. As we can see here, this is an upcoming feature by Sologenic and it's going to be an NFT marketplace built on the XRP ledger. Very interesting indeed. So let's go down here to the details of the airdrop. In order to engage the community to participate in the ecosystem and proposed governance utilities, the Sologenic core team have decided to unlock 200 million solo. So let's talk about how the airdrop will be distributed. The airdrop will take place after capturing the snapshot of the account balances on the XRP ledger, which enabled a trust line to the Sologenic gateway. And that's what we're going to go over today. The 200 million solo will be distributed to those accounts that hold Sologenic and XRP at the time of the snapshot and the ratios are basically split 50-50. That's 50% 50 to XRP holders and 50% to the solo holders. So let's jump into how to actually claim, and we're going to start with the Zoom app. Now, this one is extremely simple. The first thing that you're going to want to do is open up the Zoom app. Now, you can see the other tokens here, and you can click this add button to add a custom token. Once here, you will see the issuers of various tokens. And if you look down here, we can see Sologenic. If we look to the right, we can see the tokens which they have actually listed. And there we have Solo. All you have to do is click on that, scroll down, and simply read the warning, understand the warning, and click continue. After the transaction is processed, obviously being on the XRP ledger taking three to four seconds, we can see that it is submitted successfully and we have now set up a trust line. And that for Zoom is basically it. You've set up a trust line and you're good to go. The only thing you will need to do now is make sure that you have XRP or solo coins in your wallet at the time of the snapshot. So let's talk about hardware wallets. Some of you may have come across this web page called XRP Toolkit, and it's a way that you can unlock extra functionality from your hardware wallet by connecting it to this website. So the first thing we're going to do is click on Get Started, and we want to connect a wallet. Now here you can see many different wallets which you can connect. Today I'm going to be using a Ledger Nano S, but you can connect any one of these wallets. And for those who are interested, I actually have a link to get $50 off a Decent wallet in the description below. So what we want to do next is obviously connect our wallet. So 
After connecting our wallet and logging in, you're going to be greeted with this screen here. What you need to do is click on the account tab up here and click on assets. Now we want to add a custom edit asset. Now we're going to get the details from the Sologenic Medium blog as we saw earlier, and I'm going to link this in the description below for all those who are interested. So we can go here and about halfway down, there is the details here. So the Sologenic Gateway slash issuer. Let's copy that. Let's go back to the toolkit and type it into this issuing address. Now the currency, if we go here, we can get the currency code, which is this long number here. Copy that, paste it in. And finally, we have the limit of 400 million. Copy that, go back to here and paste that in. Let's remove them commas. And hey presto, we just need to click next, like so, connecting to the device. And all you have to do is accept the transaction, no matter which hardware wallet you are on. And voila, submitting transactions. Give that a couple of seconds. And there we have it. Sologenic trust line enabled. It's that simple. So that's it. Very straightforward. And as I said, you can do this with multiple hardware wallets as seen on the XRP toolkit. All we have to do now 